Today we are talking about our top tips for new puppy owners. Adding a puppy to your family can be such an exciting time, and although this new family member is adorable and cuddly, they can be a lot of work too. When considering a puppy or just after you've brought them home, these five tips will help you stay stress-free and build a lifetime bond together. Tip number one, remember your puppy is a baby. While puppies age faster than babies, they are still considered puppies up until after a year old. Be patient with yourself and your puppy as you get to know each other. Work together to build a bond. Remember, you and your puppy are on the same team. Your puppy isn't trying to be naughty or misbehave, they just need help to learn what they can and cannot do. Tip number two, puppies need to sleep. Puppies need up to 18 hours of sleep. This will decrease as they get older, but they get tired quickly. Make sure to give them plenty of rest and breaks from training, playtime, and stimulation. I recommend crate training them as soon as you get them home. Even though you won't leave them in the crate for long periods of time, make their crate a cozy cave for them. Use old pillows, blankets, and towels that you don't mind getting dirty or peed on. They likely will get tattered and ruined. Tip number three, train from the beginning. You want to start training your puppy pretty much as soon as you get them home. This doesn't necessarily mean teaching them commands right away, but establishing boundaries and a routine with them. Have a clear spot set up for them to eat, sleep, and go to the bathroom. For example, if you want them to sleep in a crate, keep it in the same spot in the house, don't move it around. When they are tired or it's bedtime, announce to them it's time for bed or let's go to your bed. This will help them associate that activity with that place, time, and word. Take them to the same spot outside to use the bathroom every few hours. Eventually, they will catch on and it will become second nature for them to go to the bathroom outside. Make sure to reward good behavior with lots of verbal praise, physical affection, and small treats. As you transition into command training, keep training sessions to 10 minutes or less in the beginning. Make sure to be consistent. Use the same words over and over. Don't change terms, even if they mean the same thing to you and me. Your puppy needs you to be clear and consistent. Also, don't be lazy about keeping the rules. If you don't want your dog to ever be on your couch, you have to implement that rule from day one. It will confuse them if you let them up on the couch sometimes and then get mad when they climb up on other days. Tip number four, socialize your pup slowly. Everyone gets excited about a new puppy. Kids, friends, family, and other pets will all want to meet your pup and love on them from the moment you bring them home. This can be overwhelming for your puppy as they are acclimating to a new environment. Have your puppy meet family members individually. Watch for signs of stress or overstimulation. Make sure to give your puppy lots of breaks when being introduced to new people and pets. Once your puppy has gotten comfortable at home, Work on building confidence meeting neighbors and other animals. Start with neighborhood walks or trips to the pet store. Work up to spending some time at a local dog park. It's important to expose your puppy to new people, animals, and environments, but doing it slowly will help them ease into the process. Tip number five, meet and check in with your vet. Your puppy might be as healthy as can be, but it's still a good idea to get them into your vet for a well check. Puppies are at risk for certain diseases and need to be fully vaccinated for proper protection. They may have had some shots before they came home with you, but your vet can let you know if they need any additional protection. Your vet can sign your puppy off with a clean bill of health and advise you on any additional treatments or medications your puppy might need, like heartworm or flea protection. Thanks for joining us today to talk about our top tips for puppy owners, and don't forget to give your new puppy lots of love and affection. 